Hi, welcome to Mrs. Feldman's class. We are going to conduct a science experiment. We are going to be playing a game called Red Square, and our hypothesis is that the more times you play the game, the better your time will be. So I'm going to show you the way we're going to play this game. You're going to go onto my website and click the Red Square button. And then you're going to begin by playing Red Square. You're going to right click and open the link in a new window. And then just shrink it a little. And the way you play this game is... Oh, I clicked it already. You have to hold the red square, and when you move it, the blue squares will start moving. But your red square is not allowed to be touched by a blue square, and it's also not allowed to touch the black side. The blue squares always work in a pattern, so you can sort of plan for what's going to come at you. Okay, so here we go. See, I touched the black side, so I got out. After you practice a few times, you can open up the results form in another window. So that's back on my website. Go to form, right click it, and do open link in new window. And we'll make this smaller also so you can see it at the same time. You're going to type in your name over here. And then when you're ready, you'll start it. You'll put in your name. You'll round up your time to the nearest second. So here, it's going to be only one second. And then the second trial, oh, again, only one second. You're going to do this for all six trials. And then when you're done, you're going to click Submit. And our hypothesis is that the average time will increase as you keep playing because you'll have been practicing and you'll know what to expect. And then when the whole class has participated, I will share the results with everybody.